Good evening. Today we will deploy and consume SOAP or JAX WS web service on Tomcat. Um, first of all, uh, we all know that JAX WS is a specification provided by Java on the market. There are a lot of implementation. One of them is uh, Metro, which we'll use in this session. So let's start. In uh, our example, uh, there would be two web applications. The first one uh, expose a web service. And the second one uh, contain a, a simple GSP file. Uh, inside this GSP file, we will call the web service. It's called hello world and pass it a name. The web service here will return a welcome message plus the name it received and it finally print in the client application. So let's start implementation. Uh, before we go, just we should go to the It's a little bit hanging this PC. We should go to uh, to this site and uh, download this uh, library. It's a metro dependency. Okay, I already download it here. After you download and extract, you will go get the metro folder. You will go to the lib folder and inside it you will find five library. These are libraries which we need to implement our example so let's start by creating a new maven project archetype is web app okay give it name hello server for example okay uh, let's first go to the pom and uh, set the compiler okay now oh, the source main java folder is missed here let me fix it yes this would be here okay no problem and here we should uh, okay Okay, now the error is gone, and this is source name Java folder. Let's create uh, an interface. The world inside a package name called package. Okay, let's now this method. Uh, this interface should annotate it with at method, at web method. Sorry, annotation. So it will be exposed as a web service. Okay, yes. And our simple method public string hello or accept one parameter name of type string. No, this is not supplementation, sorry. Okay, also this uh, method should be annotated with. Work method annotation. Now we will create a class which implements this interface. Let's add the interface here. Okay. Okay, this class should be also annotated with web service. And uh, we'll tell it what is the endpoint interface is equal to the qualif our qualified uh, interface. Okay, now let's come to our method and implement it. It simply return welcome message. Oh. What's happened? Plus the name it received. Okay, uh, we now should add the the dependencies to our uh, lib folder inside with inf here. 
it's not created so we need to create it create lib folder and copy all these metro dependencies here copy files clipboard and paste them here okay now we should uh, declare uh, our endpoint inside a, a file uh, called uh, sun dash java uh, sorry sun dash jaxws.xml so let's first create this file here okay what this file contain I'll copy it from here so we don't make mistakes okay okay uh, this file is used to define a, a web service endpoint for uh, the, the web servlet so we know at which endpoint uh, a server request uh, should be uh, dispatched okay uh, for example here we say that uh, there is uh, an endpoint called hello world ws this is uh, optional name you can name it as you like and the implementation is our implementation class okay inside our package and here is the url button this is a servlet at the end it should be declared inside web.xml we will see how this happened later okay so let's create uh, go to web.xml Okay. Let me see here. Okay, as we see here, first there is a listener. Okay, this is a listener for the web servlet uh, context event, and uh, this uh, this is the servlet. Okay, hello world servlet, and this is hello world servlet URL pattern which we define here. You see. So whenever URL pattern slash hello world ws is uh, accessed, it will be directed to to this to this uh, servlet, and at the end it will be dispatched to the ws servlet. Okay. So let's run and test. Okay, now let me uh, get the WSDL file. I only need to write here hello world ws. Okay, this is the endpoint. Okay, this is the service name and the port, and this is the WSDL. Very good. Okay, now uh, the first application is ready and the web service is deployed. Okay, now we need to create our uh, client application. So let's go and create a new Maven project. Also, up. and it's called Hello Client. And also, I will use the compiler here. format and the same issue here I should go here and the target runtime is okay mm, pass. Yes. okay now uh, the client uh, need to uh, need a way to access the uh, web service for this we should use a tool called 
WS import. This is a tool provided by Java. It helps us to parse the WSDL and generate the required file to access the published web service. Okay, so this is uh, this is a tool you see it's inside uh, the pin folder of our JDK so I'll move to this path okay and we'll say uh, WS import uh, we say keep to keep the generated file and then we we say P I think uh, let me remember it here yes with import keep okay uh, the P flag is the package name in which we will uh, we want our uh, generated classes to be saved I will name it client and now here we we pass it uh, the the URL this is the URL we'll copy it okay and question mark was there now it's parsing and generated the classes the generated classes will uh, appear in the same file here you see this is the client folder and inside all our uh, stuff we need to access the published web service I need to copy this client package control C and uh, paste it inside the source folder of the hello client okay I'll be paste it here and also I need the same dependencies Okay, they are here. Good. Uh, I need the dependencies from Metro to to put here inside a folder. Let me get them from here. Control C and again Control V here. Okay, now what we want to do is to create a simple GSP file. Let me create. Uh, I'll call it, uh, for example, uh, servlet. Okay, first I need. Uh, let's first look at these files. Actually, these uh, number of files and type uh, will different according to the the provided uh, wisdom we get from the provider. But here we mostly need the Hello World interface and the Hello World implementation service. Uh, so I need to uh, to import them. I'll say import. Okay. The package name client, the interface, and also we need to import also client. Okay, these are the two uh, class and interface we need to import. And here, I think here, yes, we missed uh, the page keyword.
okay i think now it will work uh, for simplicity and testing we'll uh, get the uh, object from the hello world emblem service class first call it service for example okay and then uh, depending on the uh, hello world interface service will get hello world Ample port. And now the separate and call the service. We can write out, for example, here we we'll say port dot. Our method hello world should appear here, for example, and we can pass a parameter, for example, chain. Okay, now I want to. Run this GSP file and see. Okay. And here it is, it prints welcome chain. If we say, for example, and refresh, it will say welcome, sir. That's all, thank you.